Hey guys, so I posted on my Instagram the other day and my, I have a, um, I have two Facebook pages actually. I have like a public, like, like this page or like a friend page. And the reason for that is because I can do groups on the friend page. So yeah, anyway, so there's a reason for it. But anyways, I posted a, a picture of a pair of shoes that I got for Deacon and they were blue and they were green. They're from Walmart and they were on clearance for five bucks. I also posted a pair that I got for $3. Now I've never actually bought the boys like the the Walmart's I think it's starter branch I'm not sure the brand but anyways I've never bought those shoes but Deacon had a football camp and that day I had tried shoes on him and his his tennis shoes and they were too small so I was like uh, okay well I'm gonna have to go get you new shoes and because I didn't have tennis shoes I try to keep them completely stocked up on clothes and shoes and things so I can just go to our tote and pull out whatever clearance or used item that I bought anyways my friend and I are at Walmart. She's like, have you tried their shoes? I'm like, ah, I just know the, I've heard the quality is bad. Like, I know it's not going to be as good. It's not going to last as long, blah, blah, blah. Anyways, she was like, you should look. And at that time, I had gotten a text from the team mom saying that practice was going to be moved from, it was supposed to be like three to seven, but it was moved to 9.30 to like two. So anyways, because um, he had to check in at 9.30. The boys had a doctor's appointment at 9. So I'm like, okay, well, the window that I was going to shop is now practice. So we, okay. anyways, very long story short, I ended up go finding those shoes at Walmart. So I posted those pictures. How many minutes was it? That was two minutes to explain that story. But anyways, there's the story. So I'm trying out, we're trying out a pair of the Walmart tennis shoes to see how they do. He loves them. And I mean, they're great. So everybody was saying, hey, on Cartwheel, if you go look on Cartwheel, you there's a 25% off clearance shoes and I'm like okay and I've never I downloaded cartwheel you guys told me about it forever ago and I've never used it so um yeah anyways I figured it out I was very proud of myself luckily I'd seen Megan use it on something at the snack bar a few months or a month ago when we were in Texas and I went and I browsed Target's shoe clearance section and I found a couple cool pairs of shoes. So he is currently a size 12, so I bought some 13s. And these ones here, I have no idea what brand they are. Oh, Champion. So I got the, ooh, I got him, really. I got him these ones, and they were on clearance. They're 70% off, and I've, I've mentioned this before, but you can always tell the percentage off of my phone, so it won't be weird focusing-wise. Up here in this corner, it says, so it's 70. They were normally $24.99, they were on sale for $7.48, and then I got an additional 25% off of that. So I got him those shoes. I also got him these shoes, and he's had these before. I got these in a one, so they're a little big, but he'll grow into them. And they're also 70% off, they were $16.99, they were on clearance for $5.08, and then I got 25% off of that. And then finally, the last pair of shoes that I got was were these ones, and these are for me, and I'm short. I, I'm. I'm like five. Okay, so the doctor sometimes rounds up and says I can be five three, but I'm like five two. And why I don't know if they, it's just they think short girls like wish they were taller. Sometimes I do, but jeans never really fit me. They're always too long. And I found these, and I don't know if I'm actually gonna be able to walk in them or not. But I thought they were really, really, really cute. Completely outside of my box, like really far out of something that I would normally purchase. But they were half off. They're originally thirty two ninety nine on sale for sixteen. 48 so I am I'm giving them a shot they ended up being what 16 48 25 percent off 12 bucks so I'm gonna try them out it, a lot of jeans will fit me with these so I'm pretty excited and then um, last but not least while I was there and I was like in a clearance mode I found these for the boys I'm actually gonna give them to them now they were on clearance for half off normally ten dollars they were on clearance for five dollars well how much 498 close enough you know so I got them each one of these. I thought they'd be fun at the lake just outside Boomerangs. They've never had one. So um, Boomerang, yeah, Frisbee, outdoor Frisbee disc. So anyways, out easy to throw with accurate returns. Okay, maybe I was a little excited. All right, and then last but not least, I bought my first Christmas present for the year. Yeah. Um, so this is something that Deacon will really like. This is an indoor toy, which come Christmas time, and it is July right now, but come Christmas time, it will be nice to have some things like, you know, stocked away. In years past, I've tried to start saving in July so that come December, I just have a Christmas fund. Um, I'm probably still gonna do that this year, but in the meantime, 
we've got this bad boy here. And this is, this is by Air Hogs and it is a Skywinder. It's an RC stunt rocket. It's everything that he likes. He always wants remote control things or things that fly or whatever. So anyways, I got him this. And this was normally $30.89 and it was on sale for $15.44. So it was half off. So anyways, that was my little Target haul. I wanted to tell you if you haven't used Cartwheel yet, you should. Um, you should have started using it years ago when it came out. Unlike me, who's just had the app on their phone the whole time. But uh, yeah, anyways, uh, that's it. I will uh, talk to you guys later. Bye.